welcome to another episode of What's for Dinner, dinner Tonight, my darlings. As you can see, we've got some bacon here cooking. Um, I'm just cooking it in the pan. I know you can cook it many different ways, but I just tend to do this. And I do the whole package, not to say that we're going to eat the whole package. But um, and I, real, I know you're not supposed to use that kind of tool in this kind of pan. But um, we're going to be kind of doing like a, a, a lunch for dinner kind of thing. This will be our dinner, but um, it's good for lunch as well. And um, I wanted to share you share this bread with you. I haven't had it yet. It's called um, for the best experience, warm in oven. Um, it's a roasted garlic loaf, and it gives you. Um, my camera can focus there. You can see. The, and apparently this bread freezes well. You can freeze it for up to three months if you do not use it right away. And I got this at No Frills. That's a grocery store here in Canada. And um, it tells you other things there. So I'm going to be making like uh, toasted tomato sandwiches. I um, found some lovely tomatoes and I've cut them up and put a little pepper and salt on them. We've got some lettuce and cheese and of course the bacon. And I'm also going to have some spinach. I'm going to put some spinach on mine and, of course, um, mayo and probably a little bit of uh, pesto. I'll show you that when I get to that part. But this is what we're having tonight. Toasted tomato sandwiches with this lovely, lovely bread. So here's the bacon and it's done. And the grease I'm going to put into a different container because you're not supposed to put grease down your um, drain. And I'm going to cover the yeast to keep them hot and take the grease off of them. And we'll move on. Here's the roasted garlic um, bread. And as you can see there, there's some garlic. This is wonderful. And it tastes really garlicky. So if you like, if you don't like garlic, this wouldn't be the bread for you. Um, but it is, it tastes nice and fresh. And um, very garlicky, which I, I just love that. So just wanted to share. So I put the bread slices in my toaster to toast them a little bit. So now I've got them out. And I'm going to, um, as you can see, i got my Hellman's and a bit of pesto and a little bit of um, margarine. And I've got the spinach right there. So hopefully... You guys will be able to see me making the sandwiches. So I'm going to just put some butter down here. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to have this. my trusty mayo there I should say it is Saturday night I think it's February the 11th I am kind of behind on my what's for dinner tonight I have some other videos that I haven't even posted yet I gotta get on that so there And just a little bit of pesto. Not like, not that it needs any more garlic or anything like that. Okay. Put some tomatoes on. Like so. I guess I should have put that on. I'm going to just chop it a bit for him. 
that. A slice of cheese. And we probably don't need all of cheese, so. Half the cheese on there. Oops. Oops. That's all good. Come on. Some bacon. Oh, yes. You guys have to see this. It's kind of falling off. Eh. I don't know if you can see it or not. But there it is so far. Yum, yum, yum. And put the lid on it. <laughs> put it on it. There you have it. Mm -mm, good. And then mine. I can get it off. Some bacon. Put my lid on it. And stick them on a plate here. And here you have it. This is what we're having for dinner tonight on a Saturday night. Toasted tomato sandwiches. This is Hubby's. This is mine. I'll probably make him another one. This will probably do him. But um, and it's got bacon, tomato, a little bit of cheese, mine spinach, and his is some romaine lettuce and mayo and some pesto. Mm -mm, good. Thank you for joining me. Have a great evening and we'll talk to you soon. Remember to believe in yourself, I believe in you, and you truly will go far. Thank you.